The Daily Mail front page reports that Keir Starmer has taken down a picture of Margaret Thatcher and presumably replaced it with something he likes looking at. So Keir Starmer has apparently now had this portrait of Margaret Thatcher removed from the Thatcher room in Downing Street. Now, apparently he found it unsettling. I am not surprised that you find Margaret Thatcher's portrait unsettling, Mr Starmer, because she is everything that you are not. She presided over a government of low taxes. You love to tax people right, left and centre. That's the front page of the best-selling newspaper in the United Kingdom. So if you think I exaggerate when I tell you that brain-dead right-wing mouthpieces are dedicated to making you angry about things that you shouldn't even care about one jot, there's the front page of the Daily Mail for you. You've done what? You've taken down a picture of Margaret Thatcher in your own home? Claire, what do you make of this story? Because some people might say, actually, is it that big a deal, really? Mm. And then other people saying, well, no, actually, symbolically, it's really important. I think symbolically, I think that's the thing. And I think it's really rather petty that he's removed it. Um, but why, why do we even, how do we even know this? What's happened? You know, is it such a massive big thing that the PM's came in now and moved, shifted, changed, taken away a portrait of the first female prime minister this country has ever had? She wouldn't be talking about closer ties to the EU unless they were economic. I don't think she'd be talking about them in the context of more people being able to come here. Again, goes against everything you stand for. So, of course, you find her unsettling. Why, Keir Starmer? Because you are not fit to lick her court shoes. You should, everyone, which it should be compulsory. It'd be like North Korea. We should all have a picture of Margaret Thatcher in our sitting rooms and our bedrooms and our bathrooms. And our, I don't know, billiard rooms. It's, it's incredible, right? Click here for Julia Hately Brewer hates two-tier policing.